Welcome back everyone to Exhibition of Speed and we are up here in beautiful East Canyon. And uh, yeah, we are out here. Justin, what are we doing exactly? We are comparing a Fiat 500 Abarth to a Fiesta ST. Yeah, so uh, this is a comparison that I've wanted to do for a really long time. Uh, two kind of quirky hot hatches, not your conventional GTI Focus ST, but kind of more tight and smaller and more micro hot hatches micro hot hatches or more original to the original recipe of hot hatches yep so uh yeah right here with the fiesta we have 197 horsepower 1.6 liter uh, turbocharged four cylinder and it weighs about 2700 pounds uh six speed manual gearbox and i mean look at that pearl white you can't see it much right now because the sun's not on it but it is a beautiful color it has the black powder coated wheels and red brake calipers, because it adds 10 horsepower. Wait, what? Yeah, I know. It has brake. Oh my god, look at that shit. Yes. And Recaros, follow me to the interior. And then in the Fiest, or <laughs> in the Fiat, I've been doing this all weekend. 160 horsepower, 170 foot-pounds of torque. However, it does not have Recaro seats. It has standard Fiat seats. So why would you buy a Fiesta ST over the Fiat Abarth, or the Fiat Abarth over the Fiesta ST? Well, so here are the main differences behind these cars. The Fiat is really something that for someone who wants something different. If you really need to be different and go away from the crowd, this is more of your car. Uh, the shifter, the shift knob is actually up kind of in the, in the dash. Right, so let's get a shot of that here. And it's really more of an experience car. It is, you know, it's very it's loud. It's loud. It's, it's very, really loud. It's very visceral and it shouts and it kind of dances around and plays. And regardless of, you don't even care at that point whether you're having a good lap time. You just care because it is a cute little bag of fun. Well, it's also really frenetic uh, and not quite as stable due to the nature of the short wheelbase. Mm -hmm. I mean, let's take a look at these cars here. Fiat is really built more for fun, not as much as a pragmatic and practical uh, mode of transportation. I mean, you can really see here, two doors. <laughs> well, three including the hatch. Whereas with this Fiesta, uh, it is a fully functional hatchback. It, it is short for a hatchback, but it still has the functional, fully functional five doors. Uh, <laughs> Justin and I tried to get some beauty shots earlier from the back seats yeah. from both cars. And uh, yeah, the Fiat was a little rough. But I mean, okay. How my mind kind of works is, in this case, is actually a lot more objective. I prefer the Fiesta. I prefer how on turn-in, especially with the tires that the Fiesta has, it has Firestone Indy 500 Firehawk, and those are super grippy. The turn-in is, is amazing. The steering in the Fiesta is better, in my opinion. The longer wheelbase is a lot more stable, and uh, I actually prefer the Fiat. Now, part of that's because I'm weird, and some of you may know that I have Saabs and older Audis, quirky, different things. And that's what this is. You're gonna stand out in everywhere you go. I mean, you could pull up to a meet with cars 10 times this thing's price, and you would honestly still steal some of the thunder because you show up and it's just different. It, there's nothing else that's gonna be like it, and there's not that many around. They're, you know, they are a mass-produced car, but they're not everywhere, especially not in a Bart trim. Um, and on top of that, I like the way this dances a little more. The Fiesta, objectively, Gavin's completely right, handles better, has slightly more power, more acceleration, and more brakes. However, 
This car, with the way it handles and that twitchy short wheelbase, oh my gosh, it's so fun throwing to a corner and it just wants to play and throw its rear end out every single damn time. And to me, that's more worth the experience. So I guess what you have here is two options. Realistically, better car in most every way, or a fantastic Italian espresso experience. Thank you all for watching Exhibition of Speed. Like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, etc. Follow us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, YouTube. Not, not Twitter. We don't have a Twitter. We don't have a Twitter yet. I don't think I don't see a need for one really. No, we're not. Um, that Exhibition <laughs> of Speed show. Um, go like our shit. And until next time, I've been Gavin. And I've been Justin. And that's been Randall. And that's been Steve. Steve. Scubaru Banzai on YouTube. S C U B A R U. B A N Z A I I yep. for more Fiesta stuff. Yeah, man. Go so. check out his shit. Do you have anything to plug? Nope. <laughs> Do you have anything to plug? Steve yeah. is Steve. I'm and old Steve school. is cool Hi, enough. Steve. That's all I good. I send emails. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, right. fa fax him some stuff. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay. Bye bye. Bye.